Hey there, Basement Tapes 214, that's 70s card show, John Keating. This one is a doozy for the 70s, at least. A um, couple little uh, freaks coming up here in the next couple episodes, but this is the 1971 uh, Tops. This is the 1971 Bazooka numbered test set. Got one of these. It's Carl Yastrzemski. We just talked about him a little while ago. Uh, that's the one I got. So let's read more from Beckett. Uh, there's 48 total, $51.88 average value, $2,490 total value. Set of these between nine and $1,800. That's pretty uh, impressive for an insert set there from the 1970s. This was supposedly a test issue, which was different from the more common unnumbered set and much more difficult to find. There are 48 cards, 16 panels in this numbered set whereas the unnumbered set only had 12 panels or 36 individual cards uh individual cards measured approximately two inches by two and five eighths whereas the panels measured two and five eighths by five and fifteenth sixteenths complete panels or complete boxes would command a premium above these pat prices cards 46 to 48 hunley Mays, hunter are not priced due to scarcity so uh, 1971 bazooka numbered test. Bam, uh, not numbered is that one panel, but look at uh, let's look at the the top three. Regardless, maybe they're in here. Yeah, uh, Clemente at 400 bucks peak value. Rose followed by Bench. Uh, Stremsky would be your number fourth valued card, apparently according to Beckett OPG. Uh, teams represented in this set are the Braves, Orioles, Red Sox, Angels, Cubs, White Sox, Reds, Indians, Tigers, Astros, Royals, Dodgers, Brewers, Twins, Expos, Mets, Yankees, Athletics, Phillies, Pirates, Padres, Giants, Cardinals, and Senators. Hall of Famers abound. Uh, Frank Robinson, Mazeroski, McCovey, Yastrzemski, Aparicio, Jenkins, Kaline, Killebrew, Jackson, Marischal, Brooks Robinson, Henry Aaron. Uh, Billy Williams, Bench, Cepeda, Seaver, Oliva, Clemente, Gibson, Mays, and the Jim, a catfish hunter. Let's look at the gallery. These are fun cards. Uh, blank backs here. Uh, a little bit of a oval at the bottom of the card that tells us the team and the player's name and the position. And we have instructions that say cut along dotted line. And a number one of 48 cards is Tim McCarver. Right on the border there. Bottom of the border. Center is the card number. Uh, so Mazeroski rocking at Mustard uh, John there at Veterans Stadium, it looks like to me. No, maybe that's Three Rivers. That's probably Three Rivers. My apologies. McCovey swinging away. Yes, swinging away. Everybody's swinging in the 70s, folks. Clyde Wright, who the heck is he? Some would say he was a pitcher with the Angels. Jim Merritt, Cincinnati Reds. He's uh, warming up underneath the bleachers. Louis Aparicio uh, with the White Sox. He's in Oakland getting his picture taken. Bobby Mercer getting his picture taken in New York Yankee Stadium. Rico Petrocelli, he is in spring training working on his base of tan. Sam McDowell, black Indians hat. I love it. Facade of Yankee Stadium in the background. I love it. Clarence Gaston at the Shea. They would call him Cito later on. Fergie Jenkins, he may or may not be at Shea Stadium. I'm not quite sure what's going on. Al Kaline is enjoying the spring in Florida. He's from South Baltimore. Ken Harrelson is posing in front of his buddies in the background, a doo-wop group uh, singing over an open 55-gallon burning drum there in the woods of Florida. Tommy Agee and his eyebrows are at Shea Stadium. Harmon Kilbrew is starting to look like uh, B. Arthur in his 1971 bazooka card here. Reggie Jackson, you do not argue with him. He's at Yankee Stadium. He's got several bats. His biceps are bulging. His uh, yellow and green uniform are uh, begging you to stay away and come no closer. Juan Marichal looks happy. Frank Howard, two caps, of course, uh, probably headed for a nightcap soon after that picture was taken. Bill Melton has a baseball on a baseball helmet on, yet he's leaning towards the ground, uh, maybe playing a game of street craps. Brooks Robinson is in Yankee Stadium, smiling away there. Henry Aaron, uh, say no more. He is uh, the greatest hitter of my lifetime. Larry Durker, rocking the classic road uniform for the Astros. Jim Fergosi is 
Uh, wondering what the heck's going on here. Where are the Munsters? He's card 25. Billy Williams, the second most photogenic player ever, perhaps on baseball cards. Uh, Dave McNally is confused. He's probably late for a game. He might not even be in the right stadium. He doesn't recognize anybody in front of him. Rico Cardi swinging away. He's a batting champion, I believe. Not quite sure what stadium he is in, but it's probably in Florida. Johnny Bench looks absolutely uh, ravishing there. No runs, no drips, no errors. Tommy Harper is a Milwaukee Brewer, and his hat is airbrushed. Uh, and I'm trying to look at his jersey. I'm not sure if his jersey says Seattle, whether I don't think it says Pilots, but uh, I'm confused as to what's going on there. Obviously, they had moved a couple years before. Uh, Bert Campanaris, uh, he's got the sweater uh, vest on there. And uh, Pete Rose is smiling. Probably just uh, he's at Shea. Probably just won there at the fifth race in Belmont. Uh, Orlando Cepeda is with the Braves at this point, And he is none too happy, it, is, it, it appears to be swinging the bat in front of empty bleachers. Maury Wills is now proud to be on baseball cards, and he is looking over his shoulder to check out the moves of the people trying to pick him off uh, in front of the dugout. Tommy uh, Seaver, I call him Tommy, he has his rubber jacket on. He's in the outfield pitching away at Shea. Tony Lee was swinging away there somewhere in uh, perhaps New York. Okay, uh, Bill Freehan, I'm sorry. Bill Freehan's not in the Hall of Fame. And he's at spring training, and he's uh, ready to get into the cage. Roberto Clemente with the mustard yellow hat uh, looking great at uh, Three River Stadium. Claude Osteen looks a little bit like he's uh, Gomer Pyle there uh, at Shea Stadium. Rusty Staub, uh, La Grande Orange, is uh, either in spring training or Jerry Park. I'm not sure which uh, facility was more dilapidated. Bob Gibson wearing a... Um, Almost a mock turtleneck there. Amos Otis, he's happy to be swinging away there. Jim Wynn, not too happy. Richie Allen with the Cardinals uh, and his burns are uh, dropping south in a heartbeat. Uh, love the look, Richie. Tony Canigliera is uh, on card number 45, uh, an aged Boston Red Sox batting helmet there. Wow. The aged New York Yankees. Legendary facade gleams in the background. Randy Hunley, he's at Shea Stadium saying, where's the Yankee Stadium facade? I told the cab driver to drop me off at Yankee Stadium. Uh, Willie Mays uh, looking good there on one knee, perhaps in Phoenix at spring training. Jim Hunter, I feel like we've seen this picture before on another card. Uh, he is uh, card number 48 and the final card in the uh, 1971 bazooka numbered set. So, I feel like I covered the unnumbered and the numbered here. Yeah, it's the numbered. I'm sorry. I confused myself. So uh, 214, uh, Bazooka, number 71, 1971, I mean, numbered test set. Uh, it's a legendary set. And uh, not sure if I'm going to keep going when uh, it's this expensive. So maybe someone will drop into my uh, lap. We'll see what happens. So thanks, everybody. Talk to you soon.